All right, boys and girls, so today is our last, very last lesson about addition and subtraction. We're going to be moving on to time coming this week. Um, so this worksheet here, um, it is 8.10, okay, and it's from your, uh, your practice workbook. Um, it's P155, and what you'll be doing is you're going to be working on addition and subtraction going up and down. Okay, here we do not have to draw quick pictures. Here all you have to do is add your ones and your tens or you're going to be subtracting them. So I'm going to show you how that looks, okay? Um, if you can, go grab a whiteboard marker and eraser or a pencil and paper. We're going to practice a couple before I show you how to do it on your actual worksheet, okay? So I have my supplies ready, so I want you, if you need to pause the video, you can to go and grab it. We're going to work on a couple because some of them are where you're going to have to carry over the 10. Well, I'm going to explain what that means. We're going to do a couple where we don't have to do that, but we are going to have to do that a couple that we do have to do that when we add, not necessarily subtract, okay? So what we're going to be doing here is we're first going to do an addition simple problem with no carrying over anything, okay? So if you can write um, 20 plus 30 is the same as blank, okay? So we're going up and down. Remember, boys and girls, if I were to make a T here, this would be my ones and these are my tens okay so first things first I always add my ones first okay so zero plus zero we know is zero all right then I hop over to my tens and then I add my tens two plus three is five so my sum here is going to be 50 all right easy peasy not having to carry over anything just remember we always add our ones first then we hop over to our tens okay Alrighty, so let's try another one. This one's going to be a little more difficult. All right, we're going to do 45 plus 12. Okay, so remember, if you need to draw this T, that's okay. Just remember, you have your ones, and sometimes you might have to write this number out or the word out because our O can look like a zero, and we don't want that. So we have our tens and our ones here, okay? So we have five plus two. Well, five, put five in my brain and I count two more, five, six, seven. So it is seven ones and then four plus one is five. So my sum is 57, five tens, seven ones, okay? Alrighty. Okay, we're gonna do one now where addition, we're gonna have to carry over a one. Okay, and what that means is we're gonna have to carry over a 10. So for example, here's the problem. 56 plus 37, okay? Alrighty, so I have my tens and I have my ones. All right, so. Here we go. Six plus seven. So if I put six in my brain and I count up seven, it's going to be six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 13. Well, I can't write 13 here because then I can't add my tens. So I can't show 13 ones, all right? So what I have to think about is the number 13 here in the corner, it has three ones and one 10. So this three is gonna go here because that's still in my ones. But what's gonna happen to this 110 is I'm gonna move it up here in this little, and I'm gonna circle it, okay? So that 10 gets moved up because I'm gonna add it with the rest of my 10s. So I have to add five plus three, which is eight, plus I have to add that one more 10, which would be nine. So five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So my sum is 93. Okay, boys and girls, remember, so that 13, that one came from this 13 down here. Okay, you can see the 13 like this, but I had to move that one from the tens place in my tens place, okay? We're gonna do one more, just like that, where we have to carry over that one, okay? My next problem is going to be 69 plus 16. Okay, so remember, if I have to make my, my columns here, that's okay. Alrighty, so we have nine plus six. So nine put in my brain, add up to six. So nine, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So my sum is 15, but I can't write 15 here. So I got to think, okay, 15 has five ones and one 10. Remember that 10 gets moved over here. So now I have to add my tens. Six, seven, but I can't forget to add that extra one. So six, seven, and eight. So I have eight tens. So my sum is 85, okay? Alrighty. So that is what you're gonna be doing for homework. We also have a subtraction one, which I will do one subtraction. Should be pretty easy. You're still going up and down. So we'll do 29 minus 20. So still same thing, boys and girls. You're still subtracting your ones first, okay? We never go tens first. So nine take away zero is still nine, but two take away two is zero. So I'm just gonna leave it blank, or you could put the zero and your difference is nine, okay? So I, you are going to be doing this worksheet here. Remember, you do not have to draw quick pictures. However, if quick pictures do help you, it's okay, draw them right here in the little spaces, all right? Awesome job, boys and girls. I'll see you next time.